an award-winning Mexican journalist gunned down in the lawless state of Sinaloa. Javier Valdez was driving his car before he was pulled from the vehicle and shot dead by a gunman in the street of Culiacan City around noon on Monday. Valdez is the fifth reporter to have been killed in Mexico in recent months as authorities struggle to contain the country's warring drug cartels. Police have begun investigating the incident as well as protecting Valdez's family and colleagues at a newspaper that he co-founded. Bueno, por supuesto que las actividades que Javier ha venido realizando repercuten en una línea de investigación necesariamente. Ahorita lo que nos importa sobre todo es salvaguardar la integridad de los integrantes del, del periódico, del semanario. Nos interesa sobre todo eh, particularmente la familia de Javier. Valdez was renowned for his coverage of organized crime. He had published a book about the danger journalists face covering crime and corruption gripping Mexico. In 2011, the Committee to Protect Journalists awarded Valdez the International Press Freedom Award for his work. When you assassinate a journalist with such a high profile as Javier, because in all the cases that we have seen this year, he was the most high profile as a journalist at the national level. It's a call to all the civil society. So it's an attack not only to him, but also an attack on his very rigorous day, which he was the responsible for in Sinaloa. It's an attack on journalism in total in Mexico, to all the journalists. Valdez's assassination has shaken journalists in Mexico, which is one of the most dangerous places in the world to do the job. More than 120 journalists have been killed over the past 17 years in Mexico.